Nom nom nomming everyone and welcome to Baddy Looks At Wretcher. This is a survival horror point and click game in the same sense of like the original Clock Tower series. Or if you want if you're looking at my channel, I'll think of Night Cry for recent examples, but in 2D. Now this is a demo. The game is not out yet, but my friend Walk Pixels showed me this game because he knows I like Clock Tower and this is strongly resembles sort of similar it's basically inspired it. That's basically what I'm trying to say here. That Clock Tower inspired this, not the other way around. I'm not sure if this game's ever gonna come out. I hope it does because it interests me. And I suppose hopefully that opinion stays the same once I played this demo. Although things probably changed by the time from the demo to the full game. Also, I believe Alone in the Dark may have inspired bits of this as well. Possibly. I'm not 100% sure because I've only seen the very first scene and I know it's a short demo. That's basically all I know about this game. So, let's enter. How? I have to get out of here. Oh. Well, shit. Damn, it's locked. Well, shoot. How about hiding in the closet then? Why not? Roger. We seem to be in a bit of a rush. Oh. It... Who's that? That thing looks evil. Is that, is that an actual human being? What the heck was that? That was close. You're telling me, buddy, I don't even know your name. Who, who are you? Oh, this is my save option. Sure, let's save, even though we just started. Is there anything else here? No? Explore. I'm guessing that's my objective. Uh, we could go back out that way. It seems a bit suicidal. There's nothing useful inside. Well, damn. Okay, buddy, what, what about this? Is that a safe on the floor? I found a key. Oh, well, that's handy. What about in here? Empty. Oh, damn. Can we go back out? It's too dangerous going back. Well, where, why actually is outside that door? Is that like outside outside? Or is that like to a corridor or somewhere else in a house? In fact, where are we? Are we in a house? Are we in a flipping dungeon? Where well, we got this... Bit metal like iron door. Does the key work on this? I've unlocked it. Yay! Wait a second. Wait a second. There was a note there. But there was a note. I saw a note on the wall. But to be fair, this guy is the like the most sensible person I ever seen. He's actually very sensible. I like this guy. I like this guy a lot. I don't know his name, but I like him. Now, what, what is this thing in the bottom white? Right? It's like a blue gem. It flashes a lot. Okay, so F5 does open up the save menu. That's excellent. Why? Right, let's see. Any evil lurking around you here? Uh, hello. Whoa, hello! Can I, can I free from this? Oh yeah, I can. I just must click. Okay, good. Good, my clock tower skills are here. What happened there? The wall just came to life. Oh, then, no, this doesn't look evil at all. A solemn knight carved into stone. Interesting. I see that floor there. That was all like spikes. You know what? Is there like a death scene in every single room? Let's try opening the door because I get the feeling that, 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 that this just makes me think something evil is going to happen. A ceremony drag dagger. A solemn knight carved into stone. Should I have picked up this dagger? A dagger with a wavy blade. This is my sketch scratch bucket. Oh, some almost works. So white click does lame weed stuff. I can hear whispers coming from it. That's interesting. Now that I know I can do that, we may not be in so much danger. No, it looks like a peephole. 
A circular shape is carved into the wood. Okay, so it's the same thing if you left click. The painting of a man of Victorian age. Right? I'm going to click on everything now before I left click. Because I'm paranoid. A small table with a drawer. Well, now I can see what things are. Anything in there? It's locked. Can we cut it open? No. No. Well, okay, he's no, there's no info for me. Excellent. Uh, what's this? Nothing useful. Why can I what click it? Stairs, door. Stairs, door. Uh, stairs. Well, I feel like I chose the one path here. This looks flipping evil as crap. Not that the door would probably be any less evil. I can't wait to click that book. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And this looks flipping creepy ass descriptions now, doesn't it? Interesting, interesting. Swing about. Okay, so we got some kind of demon. You got the pentagram. So basically, we're going doom. We got eyeball here. Yep, definitely doom. We got the dagger thing, which I believe is what I picked up. That looks like the same dagger. I can't tell what this little picture is here. Looks like a flipping bowl with someone pouring something into it to me. And all good, there's some complete evil pentagram. A strange metal wombus? Is that how you say it? Wombus? There's a thin hole on one of the edges. Let me guess. I think I know what's going to happen here. There's a crack on the floor. I can see light beneath. Right. It's only three slots, that's fine. I mean, this is only a short demo, but from what I've been told. Right, let's insert dagger into this. Ooh, what the hell? I don't even know why you you would just do that. Oh, good, we can take it back. All right, I'm guessing this is the next the to the door. Or not, because I can't see any light in here. So was that in here? No, it can't be because the stairs were right here next to the door. There's no light in here. I've been lied to. That gem's flashing. It scares me. A light switch. A painting of a woman with red hair. By the way, I got my speakers turned all the way down. Her head is facing sideways. I get the feeling that's gonna come. The face is gonna turn and look at him at some point. Ooh, a low shelf holding antique tools. Seems interesting. I found a little orb. Ooh, little orb. Sounds mysterious. I am saving every so often because you never know what can kill me. Small orb of amber. So, excuse me, random stranger, sir. I don't know the name of. I'm going to call you Bob. Well, no, I'm not going to call you Bob. But... Oh, this is the room. I'll call you Stando because I like Stando. And you so far seem to be a good name. A good, a good person, not a good name. What am I saying? Oh, good lightning outside. Wonderful. It's amazing. That's all I wanted in my life. He matches smiling at their efforts. His name long forgotten. With the light he... Eve's deadly widows enjoying the failures he's wait what does that even say enjoying I can't even I can't read this fine enjoying the failures he's start pleasure that doesn't that's not English to me the, the sentence does not work word properly I, I can't even speak English what am I talking about his whim to choose who let pass for they call him gatekeeper Okay, I guess this is him some kind of widow. Will you take his challenge? Oh, it's a poem. Oh, okay, now everything makes more sense. Oh, good, got lightning outside. So there's the hole. The statue of a nun. Her hands have tiny spikes and are placed as if to hold something. Orb, maybe? 
No. Well. Where else could I was thinking of? Have you got any more poems over here? What are just books? Nothing interesting. Same for that? Okay. What's this on the floor? A fragment of a stone disc. Oh. Let me guess, those are what goes in their hand. I don't think so. Okay, because... Otherwise it annoy me if I don't try it. This? No. Okay. Okay. Eat. You're the boss. You're the boss. Stand up. Do I leave the tag up there? Or do I have to search for these fragments now? Is that the door that there? Yeah, it was. Okay. My mouse is going everywhere. Even on this blue gem thing that I don't know what it is. Because the portrait, I believe, is the health bar. It will slowly go where the more panic you get and aka you die. I'm assuming this is working exactly the same as Clark Tower. I should probably have read more what on the website, which I will link in the description if anyone wants to try this. Because I think the website does talk more about what the game actually is. So do I leave the dagger in there? strange metal. No, there isn't a fin hole in there because you just jammed the dagger in there. wonder what happens if you do that enough times. Does it lead to a bad ending? Oh yeah, you can run away. I keep forgetting you can do that. Oh, you can examine the blood. blood. Crimson blood. Okay. What about this metal orb? Wait, I got an idea. Let's go back upstairs. Yep, go back upstairs. That's not upstairs. There we go. No. There you go. Take the dag out. I don't know what you were thinking of doing then, Stando. No, okay. Fine, fine, be like that. What did that book say? I can't even remember. Oh, hello. Wait, I forgot about that circular shape. Why did you walk all the way over here if you were just going to see that? Oh my lord. So, would you like the orb instead? No. By the way, do you have to walk on this f floor? There's something there. I found a small key. Ooh. Why does it get fit by the flopping wall thing again? Wait, so was this slot? I can't remember. Wait. So, small key? That. Ooh. Can we, like, combine stuff? Yes! Excellent. How, how much did you want to bet that? How much did you want to bet that that was going to happen? So, do you go here? No? Where does the stone fragment go? Wait, I know where the stone fragment goes. It goes in here. Why not in here, in here? Stupid fucking portrait. I knew that was going to happen. It goes in here. Oh. Secret passage. Hello. There's something written on one of the borders. An eye for an eye. Oh. I'm not liking where this is going to go. Not one bit. Where'd orb obtained? Uh. Little orb? Thank the Lord for that. Woo. 
That was scary for a second there. I thought I was going to die. But I think you could probably could die there. Like the war thing could probably kill you if I didn't mass click. Ooh, I'm a bit nervous. There is not. What do you mean that's not going to help? Where else does it flipping go? I'm so confused. Is there anything else I could look at? Nothing interesting, he says. Nothing interesting! This is that widow. Well, poem, should I say. Use the red orb on that scary gate. No? Silence the whispers before we receive judgment. So we gotta stop those whispers. The path opens only to those who reveal themselves. Can we put the dagger back in there? Okay, the dagger stops the whispers. Okay, that's one thing taken care of. But how do we receive judgment? Wait a second, that, that started flashing once I took the dagger. It's not flashing in this room. Is that my danger indicator? You know what? I can save. Let's see what happens. No. An eye for an eye. That's not what I wanted to read. I wanted to look at the little orb. So, okay, let's think about this. I just pu punch my mic. Well, I didn't punch my mic, but I hit my mic. Oh, a bow! Oh! Wow, that explains a goddamn lot, doesn't it? There we go, now I got my answer. Now I know what I need to do. That explains everything, I missed out a fucking bow. The spokes on the statue's hands perfectly match the small one, hose ones, and then red orb in that? No? The hands have turned it. Can I pick that back up? No. Okay, let's make some blood well. Obviously we pick the dagger back up. Because I need it for the door. Let's make some blood. What the heck's in this thing anyway? It's a bit, it's a bit. makes me a bit nervous. Do we see in here? Yeah. Ah. Ah. Hello. Ah. Did we just pick that up? I got. A, we got two red orbs. Oh God! It was an angel a second ago. It really was an angel. Believe me. I just be on my way. First things first. Oh, I see. The red orbs are eyes. Okay, that makes more sense. I'm glad I read these notes, by the way. That saved my life. Now, is this where the demo ends? I'm actually unsure. It is! Oh, okay, that was excellent. Uh, that kept me on edge all the way through. And from what the beginning of the game shown, it certainly looks like there would be chase scenes as well where you probably have to hide. So that's quite very interesting. Now, let's go back really quick. 
Can, is it this one? It is. Alright oh, everyone, let's see what happens if we don't put the little orb back down after we're picking up the red orb. I mean, we all know I was curious enough to do it, even though it's absolutely scared the shit out of me. Oh! Did I surround him and... distract him of somewhere? Just teleported him? Well, that was a bit... F freaky. Yeah. No, let's not try again. And let's new game. Let's see if we can die here. How? I have to get out of here. It's too dangerous going back. Well, okay, we can't do that. So, let us... not get out of this game. Oh! There is a time limit. Oh! He ate him! Wow, I didn't actually think there was a time limit there. Okay, I'm glad I waited. That was quite vicious, Jesus. Well, I think that shows everything about this game, this demo. So, if you ever want to like this, then please let me know in the comments and of course like the video if you did enjoy it. And I'm definitely looking forward to seeing the rest of this game if it ever comes out. Now, we'll link the website of course in the description, so if you want to play the demo yourself, feel free to. And I really am looking forward to this. Like that, that, this it's got all the creepy atmosphere that I like. But anyway, I've, I've rambled, I'm rambling now. Thank everyone for watching this Bally Looks At. I've give it an amazing, glorious. It's, it was glorious. But anyway, thank you everyone for watching and have a glorious day.